To my left, I have some song lyrics, courtesy of the Twitter page, lyric cards that look like shit posts. To my right, I have a medley of Xbox Live messages from raging gamers. Those are thanks to the Reddit No Context Xbox messages. I'm going to show you 20 insults now, and it's up to you to decide, are they the creations of high paid lyricists, or the furious button mashes of someone who's just been killed on Fortnite? As ever, think calmly and logically. You can do this. Good luck. I'd kick away your crutches. That's from a pink song about those two certainties in life. Chaos and piss. Listen here, you toe-eyed cabbage. Listen here, you toe-eyed cabbage. I wasn't born into this world so your fat ass could choke out low-level insults at me. I hope you stub your toe in the dark and have to crawl around your bedroom at 3.47am in horrific pain after going to the kitchen for a midnight snack of cheese and crackers, you absolute gormless minger. Your lips are filled with Kylie Jenner's bath water. What? Got your grandma on my dick. <laughs> Later in their song, Rack City, Tiger goes on to say, If you ain't got no ass, bitch, wear a poncho. Stop being boring by saying guns are boring. Or I will leak your IP, then shoot you with a gun. We eat pieces of shit like you for breakfast. Thanks, Kanye. Your dog's a bitch. Thanks, Michael Jackson. Asshole, just like my dad. Asshole, just like my dad, which is why I'm so shitty at this game. Like, what did I do? I don't know, I'm venting. Stick your dick in an anthill. That is the entire message. Suck my dragon balls, bitch. Call me Goku. Whilst it says this is a Machine Gun Kelly song, this particular lyric, as the picture indicates, is in fact uttered by Mr. Waka Flucker. You are the type of person that reminds me of a piece of bread I saw the other day at the store. That was just there off the shelf of the store moulding, but nobody fucking wanted it. Get a life, you seven old pods and maybe thung about growing up. You're literally the biggest loser I've ever seen play a video game. Please seek mental health counselling. You have a good night. You've got the forehead of Jimmy Neutron. And this particular gamer also wants you to know that you're a fucking stupid cunt. You look like a chair. Bit of a weird insult there, isn't it? Essentially, Earl of Sweatshirt sings about how easily you fold under pressure, just like a chair. Still, uh, a bit odd. But not as odd as, you are chicken nuggets, chips. Please. La da 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 da, I'm gonna bury you. This is from Season 3, Episode 10 of Cartoon Network's Adventure Time. I'm gonna shove a uh, screwdriver up your urethra. This is the eye-watering threat that will come about if this particular player is teabagged again. You C-word. I'ma ban you. <laughs> you C-word. Get a life, you little virgin. I'm in a hot tub with four girls who will want me. Get a life, you little virgin. I'm in a hot tub with four girls who all want me and you are crying about the boys. Are you five? Why are you time-wasting? It's the end of the game, you cunt. I'm gonna shag some galley. What do we think of the odds that they're actually in a hot tub? Bitch pussy smell like a penguin. Wouldn't hear that shit with my worst enemy's penis. It, uh, it smells like a penguin. Your nan gets bullied at bingo. And she gets bullied by my nan. Well, there we go. How many did you get out of 20? Do let me know, it always interests me. And a quick honourable mention for this Xbox message, which isn't an insult, it's the opposite in fact, but probably just as unpleasant to receive. Wait, wait, wait. Hold your horses. Um, you a girl gamer? Not to be a freak, but just when I thought you couldn't get more attractive, you started playing video games. Nicely done, milady. You've just become every man's dream woman. If you had missed a couple before, now you can be sure you've got us all drooling, lol. Oh, God.